Welcome to Reggie's Corner. All right, back at the bar. We've um, been here the whole time. We we might have. <laughs> and what's wrong with that? What's wrong with well, that? Well, welcome back to part two of our let's play of Simon the Sorcerer, or as we used to say back in the day, Smoon. Yeah, because of some uh, Amazon DOS limitations and our yes. inability to spell Simon. Which was sad in a way. It was. But it made for a good name, so smooth it is. Anyway, we uh, left up the first part in the bar, which is why we are still in the bar. No other reason whatsoever. So, we will crack on for like 25-30 um, minutes yeah. and hopefully we'll uh, solve some puzzles this time. The last and first part, um, we didn't get to do that much because the intro was super long. Yeah, but this time we'll do this. We have collected some inventory, so... Uh... We have indeed, we have indeed, and hopefully we'll get to use some of it. Anyway, hopefully you'll stick around, and I think we should just get right back into it. Let's get cracking. Yes. Right, so if I remember correctly, we, uh, at the end of the last part, said that we would try to uh, do a little hustle with the barman. Clearly he can be distracted, and uh, we want he has beer. beer. If, <laughs> yes, <laughs> and we want it. Yeah. We're back. I'd like a wet wizard, please. Hang on a moment. Use specimen jar with that beer. doesn't work. No, that's not how you do I'm it. I'm sure I've no. got some sparrow juice down here somewhere. Sparrow juice? Yes, yeah, yeah, so maybe we it? should have a keep a look out for that. I'm sorry, sir. I can't seem to find any sparrow juice. So I don't think we have what we that's need. Okay. I'm not right so sure we do either. Anything but I else, do. Sir? I'm fairly sure that we will want that barrel at some point. Maybe we should go into the other room. No. Oh yeah, you're right. There's one more room, and we did hear that there were some wizards lurking about the, well, the bar. To be honest. I've got two chows, two pongs, and a cup. And we can clearly see that they are <laughs> wizards because the game gave that away. Look at that. They think they're disguised as yokels. <laughs> they think they're disguised as yokels. You don't have any concealed dragons. Excuse me. Yes, boy. Yes, boy. Boy. <laughs> I'm looking for some wizards. Know where I can find some. Or you might be seeing any round these parts. Like, we be us humble farmers who are. Who are, and that be right. I'd be about as magical as a run of bean like it. It's not entirely mm. convincing. Not at all. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you have absolutely feeble accents, fellas. Are you saying we be fakes like? Yep. Yep. What makes you think we're a wizard anyway, like? <laughs> you have awful <laughs> accents. <sighs> oh, this one is. Yeah. That's <laughs> <laughs> when I move my mouse pointer over you, it says wizards. Oh, fair enough, I suppose. Disguise it off, lads. What did you want to speak to us about anyway? That was easy. <laughs> I want to be, a, be wizard. a wizard. You? A wizard? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> My dear boy, you can't just jump into wizardry just like that. It requires years of study. Come back next century when you're older. Next century? That's Where did this game come from? Rude. I'll do anything to be a wizard. Anything. Anything. Well, you could do us a little favor. You see, all new wizards must perform a service to the circle before being um, properly invested. Isn't that right, brothers? Mm, yeah, that's right. Absolutely. Hey, just name it and I'll do it. It's like this, see? We would be extremely interested in acquiring a certain magical implement. It's a magical staff rumored to be hidden in this area. And we would like you to find it for us. Of course they would. And then I get made a wizard, right? If you find us the staff, then we'll invest you on the spot. What does this staff look like? It's about six feet tall with a crystal sphere on one end. Any ideas where it is? As far as we know, its last owner was Nathalie, the necromancer. 
What he did with it when he died is beyond me. Should he like the necromancer always messing about with embalming fluid and giblets? Touches and some brother buried with it. No Very problem. Very grumpy We look yeah. forward to your return. Right, so we've got a quest. Yes, oh well we actually have two quests. Yes, one to get out of here and one to get some stuff. I think we should just leave these guys. I do like the one with the little onesie on. <laughs> so I think we're done here for now. Yeah, I think so as well. Definitely be back. He's still ordering beer, this guy. He's been uh, drinking for a while. Heavily. <laughs> so can we... I think we have two more directions we can go. We can go here, and there's also the other, the far left. Yeah, from the shop. Mm. Oh, oh, so we're back. we're back. So now we only have one more to go. This is actually a slightly confusing thing about this game. Yeah, it is you keep walking in the same direction, and, and you somehow come you back. come around. So we doubled back off screen in some way. Yeah. It doesn't make sense. I think we should just... You just have to learn the layout. Yeah, it's fine, exactly. But... Because it really doesn't make sense. Oh, so that oh, was right. it. Yeah. So we actually lied. There weren't more than... There were actually no screens left. No. <laughs> anyway, we're out in the forest, and the forest is the majority of this game. Yeah. Uh, well, I have a big memory of being like that. Anyway, it's quite pleasant scenery. You will probably, uh, if you're any bit like us, get super confused, super fast, and that's why we have the map. Yes. Let's see if it helps. You can get to the center of the forest, which is nice. Yeah. Other than that, I don't think it will help us that much. <laughs> anyway. Uh, no, and is this the... No, it's not. No. We, <laughs> we always think there's something about this tree, yeah. because it's a huge tree, it and looks, there's uh... nothing. Absolutely <laughs> nothing. <laughs> this, however. So, like Labyrinth. Be hearing things. I could have sworn I heard a voice. I think I need to sit down. Get off me! I couldn't breathe under there. My whole life flashed before my eyes. There has to be some sort of logical explanation for this. You can at least look at me when you're talking to me. Just because I'm begging doesn't mean I'm a bad person. <laughs> I was talking to the player, not you. Oh, right. So, you got any spare wood or not? Are you trying to build yourself up again or something? Eh? Uh, we're woodworms! We need wood to live! This stump's just about had it! Sorry, I didn't realise you were woodworm. You didn't honestly think you were talking to a tree stump, did you? Well... <laughs> no, of course not. That's alright then! Oh, he was okay with that. <laughs> I don't really care for the forgiveness of a woodworm. You bloody humans are all the same. You never give insects a fair break. It's just bloody racism. That's what it is. <laughs> Look, I didn't mean to offend anyone. That's what they all say. One misplaced foot and ten of my best friends never breathe again. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, okay? How can I make it up to you? Well... What we would really like is some really good quality wood. Something with real class. Teak, for example. Oh, that's a what? I reckon driftwood. Driftwood? How about a bit of ebony? Ebony, yeah. What about balsa? Oh, I love a bit of balsa. <laughs> ebony, balsa, ebony, driftwood. Shut up! Shut up yourself, fatso. <laughs>
the skull on the front of it. Yeah, it does. <laughs> and some of us are fat, so it's just kind of cool to see us as a woodworm. <clears throat> Fine. Anything to help a woodworm in distress. You won't regret this, you know. I'm all ready to go. <laughs> so should we go back and go to the other direction on the first one, or should we press on with this one? Um, what's over there for us to do? I mean, we, we... Oh, you mean, yeah, I see what you mean, yeah. Yeah, because otherwise we might get horribly lost yeah. and miss stuff. Yeah. Or, correction, we would get horribly lost anyway. And miss things, <laughs> yeah. Oh, this is nice. Yeah. Some squirrels. Surprisingly, they aren't for anything. Yeah, they're just there. A lot yeah. of scenery, which is nice. Okay, this doesn't help at all. Let's just press on in some direction. Yeah, <laughs> because this really doesn't help. Oh, oh. let's look at the oh. big guy, barbarian. He's crying because he's got a thorn stuck in the bottom of his foot. Ow! 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 Yeah, be tricky. Um, my foot. Well, let's just talk Can to him. Can you then. help me, boy? <laughs> I doubt it. Uh, yeah. What appears to be the problem? It's this thorn. I got it stuck in my foot and I can't get it out. Let's have a look at it then. Soon have this out. It might sting a bit. Wow! Oh. There we are. That's a oh, big thorn. Thanks. It's so quite painful. Much. Yeah. I'm forever in your debt. Think nothing of it. Okay, but here, take this whistle. If you ever need any help, just blow it and I'll be there. It's very That's handy. What a nice guy. <laughs> what a nice guy. <laughs> uh, so let's look at the whistle. It's got something stuck in the end of it. Yeah, so he knows that we can't use it. Or maybe he doesn't really care. Yeah. Anyway, can we talk to him again? I'd better not disturb him. He's still recovering from the shock of having the thorn removed from his foot. All right. <laughs> So we came from behind this tree. Should we go here or should we go to the right? Let's keep going to the right. Yeah. Always go to the right when in doubt. Or the it's, left. Uh, as long as you pick a direction and stick to it. Oh, oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> but this is the center of the forest, right? No, the center of the forest has the dwarven mine. Ah, oh, that's right. And we haven't found that yet. Oh. oh. Wasn't expecting that. No. <laughs> I wasn't up. Anyway, this is a nice scenery and we'll, um, yeah. Wow, more of it. I do remember this game being fairly big for its time. There's a lot of scenery. Oh, and here is where we started out. So yeah. we have the little stone table. A stone table used for the sacrificing of shaved lions. Not a reference to Narnia at all. <laughs> Shaved lines? Oh, they did shave him, didn't they? they? Yeah. That's cool. Even though it was slightly evil, that bird. The little ferret didn't need to die. Apparently it did. Well, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was scripted anyway, so... Uh, okay, so we... We should go here? Yeah. Making progress. Well, we haven't really done anything yet, but, you know... Oh, dear. <laughs> Going. This empty forest. Because, yeah, there's absolutely nothing here. <laughs> the wise owl. Look at wise owl. He doesn't look very wise. Did he just say he didn't look very yes. wise? Let's talk to the wise owl. Excuse <laughs> me, uh, boy? He's not promising, is he? <laughs> no, not at all. <laughs> And he just goes back to Excuse sleep. Excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow, what happened? Oh, it's uh, you again. Well, of course it is. Are you a wise owl? Oh yes. There's nothing I don't. Uh, uh... No. No. Yes. I'm just not very good with. Uh... Words? Words, yes. Uh, 
an idiot. <laughs> Have you got any hints for me? Hints? Uh, yes. You must be... Uh, um, Handsome? No. Uh, <laughs> suave? No, no. No, no. no. <laughs> Your name? Simon? That's it? Yes. Um, How did you know my name? The... Um, uh, stars told me. I'm an... Idiot? No. Uh, <laughs> no. Uh, what do you mean, no? <laughs> stars thingy. Uh, astrologer? Yes. Uh, astrologer. Yes. Yes. What astrological advice can you give me? Advice? Yes. Uh, advice? I have some... Uh, Advice. Yes. Small uh, rocks are often uh, helpful. Is that all? <laughs> For the uh, moment, yes. Great. Come back. Um, um, Later? Yes. Uh, I don't think I'll bother, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> no, so that owl is an absolute idiot, but it did drop a feather yeah. which we'll pick up. It looks wise from a distance, but it's clear. Maybe he is wise. He's an astrologer. That's not comforting. No. <laughs> Just benefit necessary to it. No, not really. Is this where we came from? Though? Yeah, I think we've been here. So we haven't been here? Or have we been? Sure. Should we just yes go somewhere and we'll see? If we yeah, we'll, we'll go it. down here and if we recognize ourselves, we've been there. Ah, uh, here's the barbarian. Yeah, so we can now press on. How do we get back here? Oh, never mind. Oh, we're here again. Yeah. yeah so now okay. let's go to the to the right instead. Because I don't think we've been here. What's the awful racket? Can you shut up, please? Sorry, old chap. Can't hear. Can you shut up for a minute? I do beg your pardon. Thank you. How can I help you? Can I have your, um, thingy? If you mean my sousaphone, then no. No. <laughs> Why not? I don't believe in giving perfectly good instruments away. How long haven't you been playing it for? <laughs> How long haven't you been playing it for? I got it cheap this morning. Yeah. At a car boot sale. A car boot sale? <laughs> I could make it worth your while. Nothing holds more value to me than music. Yeah, your let's get out of here. I bid you farewell. I'm not staying here without racket. That's good on. advice. <laughs> so we can't really go we have northeast left. Yeah. So let's go up here. Uh, I do recall that at some point we need his sisovo yeah. for something. But it's fine. It says caution paleontological dig in process. Can we talk to them? I think so. Hello! Is there anybody down there? Ain't nobody here but us chickens. Chickens? Yes. Have you got a permit for this, sir? Permit? Do you not know Damn it? I am? <laughs> no. I don't. I'm the famous Dr. Von Jones. The famous who? Philistine. I'm the most famous paleontologist in the world. I'm looking for the missing link between man and vegetable. You mean Dan Quayle? No. I mean fossils, my boy. They are the key to this mystery. You haven't seen any lying around, have you? This is mystery. As a matter of fact, I haven't. If you do see any, be sure to let me know. Okay, please go now. I think <laughs> the new seam of very promising growth strap. <laughs> please go now. It's very rude. Okay, let's, <laughs> let's uh, follow that yeah, advice. Let's get out of here. <laughs> Middle of the forest, right? if I recall. Um, and... Yeah, 
that is dwarf mine. Yeah. But first, because uh, I do remember this one, I think we can look at the little rock. So we've been told by a wise somebody. Yes. That's a wise rock. somebody. Yeah, he did say something about rocks, didn't Small he? Small rocks, often useful, <laughs> helpful. <laughs> exactly. So, uh, use rock. No, no, no. Pick up rock. Yes. Pick up rock. Oh, look. There's a word written on it. And what would What's that be? It has the word beer and short <laughs> <on> it. <laughs> of course it has. <laughs> okay, so, if we're gonna infiltrate the... Um, which we probably want to. We now have a genuine. Yeah. Uh, I think where I think yeah. probably we have a genuine nicked dwarf beer. <laughs> wow, very sophisticated, itchy though. Real dwarf hand. Yep, yep. It's a clincher. All right, mate. All right. What's the password then? And now we know. <laughs> Is it beer? You may pass. Right on. <laughs> right on. <laughs> so we're in the Dwarven Mines, yeah. and we would like a slice of this, whatever it is. Look at the Dwarf. He's assaying the gems from the mine. Right. Talk to him. Watch your fellow Dwarf. Go away, I'm busy. <laughs> What's rattled your cage? You. Now go away. I'm an inspector from head office. Where's your ID? Um, I've left it at home. Leave me alone. <laughs> okay, so that didn't work. Excuse me. Hello! Wow, heavy sleeper. So yeah, um, I don't remember if you actually need an ID of some sort. There's a lot of uh, heavy sleepers around here. Yep. A lot of these reasons. <laughs> yeah, there's been a fair bit of drinking. Um, he seems to be in a He seems to be in a drunken stupor. He is. Okay. <laughs> and what do we have here? Is it it's a key? It's not a yay. They want the key though. It's not a Yale. It's not a Yale key? Look at barrels. <laughs> they are beer barrels. Okay. There's no point, they're all empty. Yeah, that, that's uh, <laughs> why they're pretty drunk. He looks drunk. He probably couldn't tell his arse from his elbow. <laughs> he looks drunk. So that's probably all we can do down here then, because I there's so, nothing yeah. else. We did get a key though. We haven't um, been very nice to the wolves. We haven't. They don't really have any reason to like us at all. Can we go down here? Or will he stop us? I think he stops us, right? Stop! Guard! Get rid of him! He's awake now, anyway. Ouch. Duty dwarves only! I <clears> am <throat> a duty dwarf. No, you're not. Fair enough. So, nap off! <laughs> <laughs> but I'm standing in for Axe Face Skull Splitter. Why? What's wrong with him? <laughs> <laughs> um. Some trolls mistook him for a chair. I don't believe you. Fair enough. So, nap off! He's very. He's tricky, this one. Yeah. Do you accept, Do you accept bribes? 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 What did you have in mind? Oh. Hang on a minute. It had better be good. So we actually need something to bribe yeah. him with. Uh, I think this might be a good part to end up this uh, slice of the Let's Play. So that was the end of uh, part two. And we... Well, we to start off... We did some solve things. something. We came into the mine and we stole the key. Yeah, it was not a prison key. We helped uh, the friendly barbarian. We did, we did. So we actually did one or two things, and we saw a lot of the forest. And the owl was interesting. <laughs> anyway, um, 
I hope that you find viewers out there had as good a time as we had. We will definitely crack on with this. But until then, have the greatest of times, and we'll see you when we see you. Bye bye. bye. Thank you for watching the video. If you liked it or want to support the channel, please hit the like or subscribe buttons.